Hello students, in today's lecture session, we will discuss another important theory of uh, microeconomics that is Marx theory of distribution. So in this lecture session, we will uh, discuss the three important uh, ratios which are the important components of Marx theory of distribution. So do like, share and subscribe my channel for simple and precise lecture sessions. Marx considers only two factors of production that is labor and the capital. The capitalist hires the laborers to carry out the production. The supply price of the labor or we call it the wages is fixed in terms of general commodities. Whereas the share of profit is based on the value of output as compared to their wages. So Marx explained this theory by three important ratios. Uh, we will be discussing these ratios in detail in this lecture session. As we know that profits are very important uh, for the capitalists and these profits mainly depend upon the value of output. So the value of output is given by C plus V plus S. So in this case C is the constant or we call it the fixed capital uh, like the machines and V is the variable capital or the wage share which includes the wages and the salaries and S is the surplus value uh, which is the value created by the uh, labor or we also call it as the profit share. Further we can say that uh, surplus value is equal to value of output produced by the labor minus the wages paid to them. So as per Marx, net product includes two variables that is variable capital and the surplus value. Now going back to ratio, the first ratio is the surplus value to variable capital. If this ratio increases, it means that the laborers are paid less. The reason of uh, this low payment is to increase the profits. So to increase their profits, the capitalists exploit the labor. So that's why it is also known as the rate of surplus value or the rate of exploitation. Second ratio is the organic composition of capital, which tells us the amount of constant capital in the total capital. So which is given by C upon C plus V. Here C is the constant capital, uh, V is the variable capital and C plus V is the total capital. And next comes the third and the last ratio which tells us the amount of uh, surplus value in total capital. So here P is equal to S upon C plus V. S is the surplus value. P is the profit and uh, C plus V is the total capital. On uh, further simplifying this equation, we get the equation number one, where P is the profit, S upon V is the rate of uh, exploitation and uh, C upon C plus V is the organic composition of uh, capital. So if S upon V is considered constant and the ratio of constant capital is increased, then the cost will increase and rate of uh, profit will fall. So I hope now these three ratios are clear to you. So this was all in today's lecture session. Thank you.